So hello, I'm Grivni. This is Responsible from Corval.com. And as you probably know, the Power BI team has released their May 2018 update. And it is loaded with a lot of features. And uh, one of my favorite is, of course, the updated drill through functionality. So I thought we actually go through that together. We will do that in a second. Stay tuned. <laughs> So the drill through functionality is extremely good. The thing that was missing it was when you're actually drilling through to a new page, the filters that you had applied on the previous page were not passed to the new page. So let's say that you have a, a sales um, report and then you had filtered by country. So you wanted to see only Spanish products. And then when you read through from a specific product to a read through page, the filter span did not pass through. So in this new functionality, they have fixed that and they have made an amazing job. I was thrilled when I heard that they were doing it. I was even more thrilled when I saw how they actually solved it. It's brilliant. So it's actually recognizing the filters that you have and it passed them automatically. You can, of course, add. So it is fantastic. Let me show you and uh, I'll see you at the end. Okay, so here we are in Power BI and this is a Northwind data set that we always use. So this is a data set that is free for everybody to use. So I have a link down below where I have a video where I explain how to use it in case you want to use it too. So what we're going to talk about today is read through functionality that uh, the update uh, made 2018 and I think is absolutely fantastic. So what I have here is just, uh, you know, a report with sales by category, by product, uh, by, you know, trend line. And then I have a drill through details page. So here I can actually do through both on product and category, as you can see here. So let's try to see how this works. So you just pick a product here, Camembert, drill through, drill through details, and then it will take us to this page where we can see more just about this specific product. The issue that was before with drill through is that if you had any other filters on the pane, they were not passed along. So if I had, for example, filter here by Brazil, then when I went into my drill through page, Brazil was not passed as a filter. Now it is. Let's take a look. We take the camembert is again and oh, out, out. Let's do it again. Remove the filter. We take it there. Drill through details. You see here we had drill through on camembert. And now you can see that the country is Brazil. You can see it here. If you turn this on, the, if there are any other filters available on the report, what you did the drill through, they will get passed along. And then we can see it here. And it's done automatically. You don't need to do anything. I think it's fantastic. They've done really, really good job. Let's put a filter date. We say we just want to have the few months and do another drill through. I wonder if, no, we need to do another drill through, obviously. So let's find our cheese, go there, and you can see the date filter has been passed on too. It's fantastic. And we can do the same that with categories. I have, I have this gorgeous tooltip also. There is through details. You see, category now has been um, passed together with country and date. Fantastic. Isn't this really cool? If you don't know what this tool tip is, I have a video also on it. This is a you know, functionality from uh, two months ago, I think. But this is really, really good. Another thing, if you want to know how I did this, it's just a title that it says if categories has been drilled through, you know, if it has been filtered, just give category otherwise the product name. So I can use the same drill through page for two things. I think it's really, really good. Especially, you know, oftentimes you just want to show the same information for different categories. And this is a gorgeous way to do it. But now the filters get passed on. 
really good, isn't it? I love it. Let me know if you like it too. So what do you think of the Dreams Show feature? Isn't it great? I have actually a deep dive on drill throughs on another video that I will link down below in case you don't really know uh, how drill down or how drill through works. Okay, so I already have you covered. Don't worry about that. What is your favorite feature? Let me know in the comment box. I will actually do another video with my second favorite feature, but you will see that tomorrow. See you then. Bye.